location is Hammersmith. Please mind the gap. Morning guys, it's Vlogmas day four and I'm up very early. I'm in Hammersmith and I just went to grab some fruit salad because I didn't eat anything and then on the train I was feeling a bit woozy because I had an empty stomach. I'm off for a meeting um, and then I'm going to meet my mum afterwards and go to Westfield. I actually have a wet face, that's how much it's raining outside. Anna's here. Hello. What are you doing for the rest of the day? I'm going to a yoga class. Oh. And then I'm going home. I'm going to my laptop. Um, I've never done it before. What, yoga? No. I'm intrigued. I'm intrigued. It's like, hum. Um... touch my toes. <laughs> Namaste. I'm now going to get back on the tube and head to Westfield where I'm meeting my mum. So the meeting went really well. Me and Anna are working on some kind of semi-collaborative videos for January, but we've got so much happening over Christmas and she's going away that we're going to have to get it all sorted like this week. I'm now heading into Westfield to go and find my mum. Westfield have their ice rink up. Look at this guy being fancy. It's 11am on Thursday and it's so quiet in Westfield. I've never seen it like this. It's ridiculously pleasant. First thing I need is Christmas present wrapping equipment. This is the wrapping theme I'm going for. The brown paper with the red and white string. American Eagle has finally come to the UK. And it came to London just in time for me to grow out of it. I'm really not a big fan anymore. Just got the Frozen songs out of my head and then we went into the Disney store and they were playing it. So now I've got Let It Go back in my head. Now into my favourite store. Well, I'm having a bit of a rest and catching up on my emails while my mum gets her nails done. She's going away for the weekend and she needed to get shell up. So we're at one of those nail things in the middle. My feet hurt from all the Christmas shopping and it's getting quite dark now, it's actually proper dark. I'm going to head home and I need to do some work, I need to schedule Vlogmas Day 3 yesterday's, which you should have seen by now, it's all getting very confusing for me. And I think I'm going to arrange the lounge ready for my birthday because tomorrow morning I'm doing something really exciting with my sisters and my friend Gemma, um, so you'll see that in tomorrow's vlog. I haven't got much time tomorrow because when I come back I'm going to be doing lots of cooking and prep for the party so I think tonight I might try and get the room ready. Okay this is going to be my setup for the next hour. Laptop, notepad, headphones, pencil, external hard drive, charger, phone. I'm going to sit and edit this vlog so far. I've already got into my onesie. I just It's too cold and wintry so I'm going to edit this video. I don't know how long it's going to take me but I'm going to do this and then I think Rich will be home but I need to sort out that room. While I edit I'm watching Friends on mute. I don't need the sound because I know all the words. Look who's home from work. Hi. What did I do? You left the car. <laughs> I can't even talk about it. <laughs> Rich got back and said where's the car and I went oh crap I drove to the station this morning and then I forgot because mum drove home from Westfield so the car is at the station it's probably really lonely and cold I feel sorry for poor Lenny my car's called Lenny in case you wondered our car um, oh and yeah our car <laughs> I always say my car definitely what about me I've never got to go and get it yeah you do your coat's still on there and everything. You're still dressed for the outside world. Look, I'm in a onesie. Not appropriate. <gasps> oh, you're so cold. Will you help me organize the room tonight? Maybe. Oh, he said maybe because I'm vlogging when I just asked a minute ago. He said no. I'm just writing a blog post for these amazing dairy-free brookies, I call them. They're like brownies and cookies. And I'm going to be making these tomorrow in the vlog. But I've also got a blog post coming up. They're amazing. Okay, we're going to sort out this room for my birthday. Rich, unnecessary. Okay, so what we're gonna do is have a table up over here. We need to like get rid of all the kids' toys. And a table over there, Rich. And then we'll move the sofa. I don't know. Do we need a low table? No, we're gonna put a table there for the food. Let's 
do let's put the table up and see how if we can hide all the toys under the table feeling really stressed now because the plan was to have everyone kind of sitting on the floor and eating so i thought that might be more relaxed and if you're sitting at a table then you're kind of stuck talking to the person opposite you but then i've just realized it might be quite i mean i don't mind sitting on the floor eating but looking at rich as a guy it's a bit awkward and you can't really put your food on your lap but now if i put a table up i don't have enough chairs for 16 people Ah, uh, I'm stressing and I have no one to help me because this is what boys do, they just sit on their phone I'm and useless. I need your help, I'm stressing out. And Rich is sitting there and being like the most annoying boy with stupid suggestions. Okay, we've come up with a plan. We're gonna bring the coffee tables from the other lounge in here. And they're like low tables, but like what Rich was suggesting, annoyingly. So that some people can eat on there if they feel uncomfortable. Some people can sit on the floor. It'll still be casual. I'm happy with that. So we're just gonna clear the room now. All right, let's see if these twinkle lights work. Woo! They work. Like that. I think it makes it Christmassy because I'm not allowed to get my own Christmas tree until after my birthday. Apparently it dies before Christmas Day. So I'm going to hang these. To make it feel festive. So we just put this table up and oh my gosh, the arguments. I think I'm in a lot of trouble. It was, we didn't realise that it comes apart in like four different pieces and it's pretty much taken us about 45 minutes to put it back together after taking it apart. So, um, whoops, but it looks nice. You can have all the food on there. I think that'll look nice. Okay, so I'm just putting all the cutlery and glasses out ready. Um, the kids use this room to play in, so I can't really set everything up yet. But I can put some of it out, just so I know what I've got. We're just watching I'm a Celebrity Get Me Out here, which is probably a favourite programme in the house at the moment. I love it. I'm just reading through all your comments from Vlogmas Day 3. Just wanted to say thank you very much. They're really nice, and a lot of you are finding um, Ungrateful Potato quite funny, which is funny. He is a bloody Ungrateful Potato. Thanks for your comments. I'm really like surprised at how like engaged you guys are with these vlogmas vlogs. I'm really happy though. I read through the comments every night. It's like my favourite thing to do. So I think I'm going to end this vlog here. Maybe I'll show you my evening skincare routine first actually because I think this is going to be a really short vlog. I haven't done much today again, sorry. But tomorrow's going to be really fun. Me and my two sisters and my friend Gemma. Have I said this already? I don't think so. We're going to... Innocent Towers, which is the offices where Innocent Smoothies are and they're going to give us like a workshop and show us how to make smoothies and we're going to be knitting tiny little hats to put on the smoothies because they've got their big knit campaign. So that's going to be really fun and then I think I'm going to be cooking and getting ready for the party the rest of the day and Saturday and someone commented saying that my sister Carly should have a food YouTube and show us how to make Gravelax. She'll be in my vlogs a lot over the next couple of days and we're going to be making lots of food so definitely come back to watch those she's so good at cooking my sister Carly and her husband Ben so I'm just gonna finish reading through all the comments and replying to as many as I can and then I'll show you my evening skincare routine okay welcome back to my messy bathroom I have a cup of hot Ribena because my throat is still really sore and hot Ribena is the best thing for a sore throat well hot lemon and manuka honey is the best but hot Ribena is pretty good so this is what I'm gonna do tonight Emma Hardy cleansing balm followed by first aid beauty exfoliating pads, followed by La Roche-Posay Cera Zinc, followed by, hmm, I think Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair, and then Lizelle Super Skin Moisturiser. Okay, skincare done. I'm now gonna finish off my routine, brush my teeth and get ready for bed. So I'll see you guys in the morning. I'm so excited to have a little like fun adventure with my sisters and friend. Sorry, adventure. 
I don't know why that word came out of my mouth, but just like a fun morning. And then it's my birthday so soon. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching today. Sorry if it was boring again. I need to stop saying that at the end of my vlogs, but I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.